This is Neil Young's Dead Man from the soundtrack Dead Man. It's uh, for the movie. It's a really great acoustic piece. I'm going to show you how to do it. This is just the acoustic version. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to play it once through. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to cue up the chords so you can orientate yourselves with them. Then I'll take you step by step. Let's try this out. start off with the chords. Uh, I'm not going to read them out because I've already shown them so I'm just going to walk through it to the B minor. This song uses a lot of palm muting. So look at the action of this finger here as it's bouncing on the on the bass note. So like that. So you get that right. It's kind of how he does it. And the next little twill is on the, uh, you play an open, so D minor, but a B minor, sorry, open. So it's just on the uh, E string, second fret, then to an E, so. And then you're just on the E, you're just taking your little pinky finger and you're hitting again on the second fret. Just a little light little knot, going to a D. Lifting your middle finger off of the second again. And again. And an F sharp. And then you're just taking again your pressure off the, um, uh, the F sharp and basing it. And then placing it back down again. And then you go through. Putting a lot of emphasis on the on the A section there. So let's work through that one more time. Lots of palm muting, bouncing off the bass strings using your finger. Then an open, and E, and there, D, same thing. Okay, the next part is this. So all you're doing is, is on the bass string, E, I mean A, sorry, string, open twice, second, fifth, second. not comfortable doing this he doesn't actually do that it's a um uh, he does that on the electric guitar but i find it sounds quite nice adding it in so if you didn't want to include that it'd be something like this but you've got to admit 
it sounds a little bit better and more authentic. Add that in. That's pretty much the song. Um, like I said, it's not really too hard. Just get the par mutings and listen real closely because there's a lot of par muting and time those um, uh, twills. Okay, I'm gonna play out and I'll cue up the chords again. And uh, like I say, this one was quite tricky to explain. Uh, hopefully, it'll give some pointers. As always, check out guitardragons.com and uh, hopefully this has been helpful. Thank you.